morning, everybody. It's Amanda here with Compass. Welcome to my tip of the week. I'm going to be talking about the East Bay market today, and I'm just going to give a general overview. Now, remember, there are tons of microclimates and neighborhood specific information out there. This is just, again, general overview. If you have any questions on specific areas or neighborhoods, please reach out to me and I can do a whole other video on a specific neighborhood um, upcoming. But anyways, in general, we're seeing homes staying on the market longer, prices are coming down, and um, basically we're seeing just an overall slowdown of everything. I see it as the market correcting itself with the increase in interest rates. So it's always kind of like a balancing act. Interest rates go down, housing prices go up, interest rates go up, housing prices go down. It's kind of like this leveling act. And so anyways, it's less competitive out there. Now think about supply and demand. There's still a huge demand out there and not a lot of supply. Inventory is still low. So homes are still selling, but they're not selling as fast and they're not selling as high of a price as we've seen in years past. So bottom line, things are still selling, but it's a great time for buyers to get in right now because things have slowed down. And if you're a buyer looking to get in, yes, the interest rate is higher, but remember you can always refi later. And if you buy in now when it's less competitive, you're gonna be able to negotiate the price. And on top of that, you're not competing with people that are removing every single contingency. So you really have time to make an informed, educated decision when you want to, if you want to buy this house. That's my takeaway. I hope you guys found this information useful and I'll see you next week.